Hey guys, Mr. Thrifter here, and uh, I just want to show you guys some books that I got recently. There's a, a book distribution warehouse near me that, you know, does wholesale books, and they they sell mostly new books, um, but they do have a, a section in the back called the Scratch and Dent section, where they uh, they essentially just sell books that are new, they have to sell them at a discount because they either have a scratch or a dent or what have you, so they can't technically sell them as new. So normally the books go from like a dollar to three dollars in that section, but this past weekend they had books there for only a dollar. Literally every book in the scratch and dent check in the scratch and dent section went for a dollar. And so I went there, started scanning some books for Amazon and some of these are just some of the books that I found. So I, I got, you know, the Kobe Bryant, the Mama Mentality, bought a couple copies of this book. This is a really hot seller on Amazon right now. Um, yeah, here's a book for the, the series of unfortunate events. I, I bought a bunch of them, but these books are the ones that I want to show you guys. It's not impossible to find really expensive books out in the wild, okay? These ones are fine, but these ones are, are on a totally different level. So when I went into the thrift store, or I'm sorry, not the thrift store, the, um, the, uh, d the warehouse that had the sale going on, I, I scanned these books and they came up to be uh, really, really good sales ranks, like under a thousand in the States, which is really, really good. And um, the price was, was pretty decent as well. So I figured that's a no brainer. I'm going to buy these, both of these copies. I put them in my cart and I noticed these um, labels on here, autographed edition. And I was like, uh, well, that's, that's interesting. Like I didn't really think much of it until I got home. And because the reason why is because there are books that exist with signed copies of the books, right? But, but they're just digitally printed on, like they're not actually real signatures. So that's kind of what I thought that these books were because they both had signed copies. So I just figured that's how they were printed, but no, upon examining them, when I got home, this signature in this book and the signature in this book are slightly different, meaning that they actually were signed by the person who wrote this book. Now, if you know anything about Pete Souza, Pete Souza was the uh, the White House photographer for Barack Obama. So that's when I was like, oh, wait, maybe I shouldn't send this into Amazon just yet. Let me just see what this book sells for signed on eBay. And I'll show you guys exactly what that looked like. So this is what the book is going for on eBay. Here are the sold listings. Okay, so you got $181 uh, sold. Um, brand new. Now I sold mine as like new because it's got a kind of like a little rip in the cover. Uh, so I, I made sure I, I was aware of that. But look, here is all of the ones that have sold recently. This is just a few days ago. One, uh, 181, 326, 297, 98 dollars, 271. Um, I mean, these are Canadian prices, but you could pretty much, uh, you know, calculate what they'll be like for the States. Um, this book sells for a pretty penny and it's pretty amazing considering I got this book for a dollar. I got it literally, I paid $1 for this book and I'm going to flip it for, you know, at least it looks like a hundred bucks. You know, it, mine is kind of, you know, um, it's got a little rip on the cover, but inside it's completely untouched. The, the pages are crisp. Um, so you know what, even if I get 50 bucks for it, I'm happy. I'll put it up for sale and I'll show you exactly how much I sell it for as soon as the auction is finished. Well guys, here it is. It just sold. Uh, the auction just finished. Um, $88 was the winning bid. Um, honestly, that is more than I thought I would get for it. Uh, I'm just happy that it it, uh, it ended with 31 bids. So, you know, I got another one. Uh, maybe I'll make another video uh, and upload that one to show you guys how well that one does. So there you have it, guys. Um, just wanted to show you that it is possible to find, like, great finds out in the wild. Um, I know sometimes these days there's more and more people uh, reselling and selling Amazon FBA, but honestly, like these books exist. Like I found these for a dollar. Like even if I found them for 10 bucks, I'd be amazed or even 20 bucks. Like the, the price tag says, but I got them for a dollar simply because these copies are, are kind of ripped. And here's just one little rip on this one. This is the one I currently have on eBay. But if you look at it, like the barcode scratched off, but it's immaculate. There is no usage of this book. And you know, eBay is great for signed copies of books. 
I'm hoping that uh, I get just as much money for this one. This one, the rip is right there. Uh, but um, yeah, it, honestly, guys, uh, if you guys want to see more cool finds like this, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will keep uploading cool stuff that I find at thrift stores. Thanks for watching.